this video we will learn how to create user surfaces inside CFD post from existing surfaces or from interfaces for that we'll be using an example from CFX in this case what we have here is a spiral coil where potential gradients or electric potential volts have been provided across the two ends of the coil that will heat up the coil and then it will pr produce a temperature gradient or temperature distribution on the surface of this coil. Now let's say we're interested to know how the surface temperature or rather how the temperature distribution looks like on a plane which is a bit shifted away from the surface of this coil or the interface of this coil. Now that shift can be inside the coil or outside of this coil but that might be a bit tricky to create that user surface given the shape of this coil here which is spiral. Uh, inside CFT post there is a way that we can create the user surface very easily. I'll show you how to do that. First we have to go into insert location then user surface. Once the panel for the user surface comes up we'll go into domains as all domains and we'll change the method from file to offset from surface. Now once that is selected we'll have to select the surface name and here we'll select the one of these interfaces as the surface name. Once that is done we'll just keep the type to normal and the mode as uniform and in the distance we can put in a value let's say we want to see a user surface which is about 0.02 meter shifted away from the interface of this coil and then we'll click apply now, as you can see the interface is shown in blue which shows the temperature distribution but if I turn off this interface here you see that this new user surface has been created which is inside this coil and shifted by 0 0.02 meters. Now this is very handy because now what we can do here is we can color this user surface as variable and then we can plot the temperature distribution on this. So this shows how to create a user surface using an existing surface or an interface inside CFT post.